Hi, my name is Lauren. I am 25 years old and I am a journalism graduate. Pretty much right out of college, I nailed my dream job being a blogger at Thought Catalog. It's a pretty prestigious website in my opinion. You may have seen some of my work. It's been a long journey for me realizing that women don't have to live within the confines of this patriarchal world. I don't need a man. You don't need a man. We don't need men. It's really amazing when you come to that conclusion that you can live life alone and be happy and fulfilled. And I just want to share that message with people through my work and through my writing. So I start my day just like anybody else. I wake up bright and early to get a head start on things. My alarm goes off and then I head downstairs and get breakfast. I personally think breakfast is one of the most important meals of the day in order to have energy. I like to make myself vegan food. I like to make myself a smoothie and just be really pumped up to put some positivity back into the world. Uh, and then after that, I'll go and I'll take a shower. I like to freshen up, feel clean and warm first thing in the morning and head out to take on the world as a strong, empowered woman in 2017. I haven't felt the loving embrace of a man in like three years and I'm totally okay with that. <laughs> I inspire people. That's my full-time job. I inspire women to realize their inner strength and that they don't need to be with anyone. They are beautiful, they are strong, and you can be happy on your own. And you know what? It's a pretty fast-paced, stressful environment working in the journalism, blogging sphere. You have to be able to compete with everyone. You have to be able to get those articles out quick. It stresses me out a lot, but I won't let it get me down. And then there's the evening. First things first, I go to Tesco and I pick up some groceries. I gotta make myself a healthy dinner. I'm a strong working woman, gotta keep the energy up. And luckily I only have to make dinner for one. It's super easy, so I have plenty of time to relax and have a glass of wine. And quite frankly, it's just a life where I have so much more time for myself. And I don't have to worry about making a huge dinner, of course, not a family person, just for myself, but I still eat healthy, I still make my kale shakes. I'm not beholden to any little monsters running around the house. I'm not beholden to some man who's gonna be mansplaining at me and talking down at me. I get to be the ruler of my own life and my own domain. I mean, I've never needed a man anyway. I've never needed a guy to help me with the furniture, to help me mow the lawn, help me open jars. I've been able to do that all for myself and that is the future of the modern woman. As they say, the future is female. I just don't think there needs to be these strict, oppressive, outdated guidelines that we had before. Bring a guy home on the first date with no questions asked and I don't even need to make him breakfast in the morning, hell. I don't even need to know his name. It is amazing how much our society has progressed and it's just given me so much freedom and fulfillment both sexually and in my personal life. I ask for a guy's number and he's just so forgetful he gives me the wrong number. Like what a jackass. Why would I want to get married? Marriage limits people so much these days. I mean as an unmarried woman in approaching her 30s, I can have it all. I can have a starter, a main course, and a dessert every single night. Ask what married woman can do that. They can, because they're expected to be beholden to these patriarchal confines of beauty by their husband. Oh, and I do, I just wanna to touch on this again because I feel like you may misrepresent me. Uh, I'm definitely not lonely. Not, never felt that way before, just, not lonely. <laughs>